Okay, so I just got back from shopping. Oh my god. So I just got back from shopping. I went to Ulta and I bought quite a lot of products there. Um, they had, like, this is my first Ulta trip. I had $40. I didn't spend it all there. So I was like, I'll just go crazy and buy, like, tons of crap I don't even need. Um, but I didn't end up buying it. I didn't know they had drugster, drugstore products there. So I bought a lot of drugstore products. And my Ulta has e.l.f. in it, and I'm obsessed with e.l.f. So that was really exciting to see. So let's just get started with this. Um, I tried to remember the prices. So since it was my first time, I bought a little card thing. I don't know what it was, but I bought it. So the first thing I wanted, I wanted to try the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil, and everybody's raving about the milk one. So I'm just trying this one, and it's the milk one. It looks like that. It's really white and creamy. So I really hope I like this product. This is about $2 because I got 20% off my purchase for signing up for their membership. So that was exciting. Then I bought an e.l.f. eyeliner and shadow stick. I have about four of these, but I didn't have it in black. I was like, I have every other color except for black. So that's about black. So on this side, it's just a shadow. And then this side, it's a liner. So it's really unique. So this is what I take travel days. This was exactly $3. Oops. Then I bought an e.l.f. eyelid primer. And this is sheer. So it's just sheer. But this is my first primer, eye primer, so I'm really excited. This was a dollar because it's not from their professional line, so it just looks like that. Exciting. So that's that. Then I bought an eyeshadow. This is my first eyeshadow I bought for them. And it chipped really fast. Like, I dropped it, like, two feet, and it chipped. But it's in coffee bean. So it's just this really, really nice brown color. I'll swatch it. I love browns and nudes and stuff. I don't know why. So that's another e.l.f. product. Then they also had Maybelline products and I kind of went crazy on Maybelline products. So I bought two baby lips because everybody is talking about these. I got Peach Kiss which is a nude color. And then, oh, the eyeshadow right here was $4. Okay, back to this. And then I got Pink Punch, I think. Pink Punch, yep. And these are just, like, really cute colors. When you want to wear a chapstick, but you don't want to put it on for your lipstick, you just use this. And you're good. And these are about $3.50 each. And then I bought an Instant Age Revive Foundation. I've had this before. I used it all. I absolutely love it. It gives me so much coverage, which I really, really like. So it's just look like this, and I'm in caffeine, and this was, I think, $10, but you get a lot, so I don't really go over a lot. Like, I don't buy expensive makeup. So then I also bought another Soft Lips chapstick, and this is a tinted one. It's in pearl, it's just a cute pink tint, you won't be able to see it. It's a pink tint. That's my new crave or rave now. Like tinted chapsticks. Then I bought a Carmex um chapstick. This is just the cream kind and cherry. That was I think this was only like 50 cents. It was like in the checkout aisle. Didn't know they bought it. Then I bought a Revlon Color Stay. Um, mineral finishing powder and sun kiss radiance. They have 70% off, so that was really cool. That's what it looks like. I just needed a new bronzer, and this one looked really, really cool. Like, it just gives you a really nice gold color. I really like it. Then I bought a Mel London Stay Matte Pressed Powder Shine Control, and I'm in sun. Sandstorm. So take this. It's a 
finishing powder, just white. Gives you a nice coverage, but I do need to touch up with this more. It's more of the little low end makeup, but I really liked it. I'm in my drawer right now, so that's why I like keep reaching down. So I bought two L'Oreal pigments, and I have Visionary, which is this really cute gold sparkly color, and then Exciting, which is the white pinkish color. Those were $2 each. The finishing powder right here was 3 and this was about 5 Then from Wet n Wild, I bought a blush. And it's in pearlescent pink. This is really nice corally color. I already swatched it in the store while I was getting in line. It's a nice corally color, which I absolutely love. Okay, let's see what else I bought. I really think that's it. I really think that's it. That's all I bought. Oh, no, I didn't. I bought one more thing. So they sell a bed head at my Ulta. And um, I'm obsessed with bedhead products. So it looks like this. And it's a Cyber Actic eyeshadow. Regular $16. I got it for four. And it's a navy blue color. I want to show you how pigmented this is. Look at that. Oh, I fell in love with it. But I don't wear blues, but I bought it because it's bedhead. Bedhead is so expensive. It's only $4, so it's like, don't need it. But I'll buy it. Um, so I really think that's it that I bought at Ulta. I bought quite a bit of stuff because it was my first trip there. So I was like, you know, I'll just splurge and do it anyway. So I did it. So that is my haul. And let me know if I should go buy more jumbo eye pencils from NYX. Because if I really like this, I'm definitely going back and buying more. So trust me on that. So thank you guys for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.